Welcome back to this channel. Let's continue with our full tutorial in AutoCAD for mechanical engineering. This is lesson number nine. In this lesson, we'll uh, continue to talk about the uh, modified commands part four, and uh, this is the last part. Let's just go ahead and uh, continue with uh, the length fan. Length fan, uh, how can we use this command? So we'll just uh, activate the command here. I activate, and then uh, we have this option. We have the dynamic total and the percent delta. So if I click in uh, dynamic and uh, select the line, so I can ju just, you know, increase or decrease or just increase uh, how much or just put here 30 so now uh, my line is uh, 100 so before was it 17 and now is 100 the other option here in uh, the length fan is uh, we have the total so the total means that uh, we need to specify if i put like 200 in my line enter just click here and then put like 200 so right now this line is 200 and it can uh, confirm by dimension if we put here my size click click you can see this is 200 so that's the way we we use uh, uh, this command okay uh let's move on the next uh, option in uh, the length fan is uh the percent if I click in percent, just put here, we just put like uh, 120, okay, 120, and then click, you can see that it will increase in both uh, sides, can it be to the right or to the left, that's the way we use uh, the length fan. Let's uh, move on and uh, talk about the another command, which is uh, the, so we have here also the edit, uh, edit, in this case, it did uh, pull line, it did spline, it did uh, hatch, it did array. So if you have one of these uh, drawing and want to change uh, some spe specification, we can just go there and then we can edit. So let's move on to the next uh, command. We can use about. We can talk about the the brack. The brack is this one here. So the brack, and we can brack command. We have the explode. We have really, uh, talk about this command. In the last number two, I think, or yeah, part two. So if I click there and then come here, enter. <coughs> now this is not; it is not a pull line anymore. If I click, you can see uh, this command will are yeah, now separated. So this is mean that they are not pull line anymore. If I want to break, come here and then I can break. Click, click. So it is. Break. If you want to join, just go there again and then come to joint, click there, select, select, and then enter, we just join. If you want to make a, like a break, because if I click here, it means that this is one line, okay? If you want to divide this line, if you want to divide, we just come here and then divide that line by clicking a break at the point. So select the object, this one, and then break, we break here. So, so right now it is break. This line is divided. For instance, if I select, you see, you can see. If I, I delete, all this part will be delete because they are divided. So that way uh, we use uh, this uh, this command. And uh, if we want to convert these, uh, you know, single lines in a pull line, we we'll just select all the objects right and then click to the joints so now they are pull line again so if, if, I, if i click there you can see that you know they are all selected meaning that they are pull line so that's uh, pretty much what we have for these uh, uh parts and thank you very much for watching and uh next lesson we'll just start uh, st uh, start talking about the the drawing so we'll just make some practice from what we have learned uh, so far see you to the next uh, lesson